Hi folks, Clyde here. This week there's been a lot of chatter on different forums concerning automating East-West Quantum Leap play in DAWs. And apparently some of the more expensive DAWs, it's a complicated process. So let's have a quick look and see how easy it actually is in, in uh, Mixcraft 7 here. So what I've done is I've loaded solo cello into a, an instance of play, one mic position, and I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to automate the volume control there. So first I have to find it. You see we have a choice of what we can automate. This is East-West choice, not Mixcraft's choice. So there we go. Instrument volume. You can see that it's set there. So let's just add a couple of nodes here and there. Maybe one every bar. Okay, so up and down and up, down and up and down. Have a listen and watch the volume control over here. Okay, that's all well and good. It seems pretty easy to me. I don't know about you. But let's have another look here. The basic complaint was this fellow was, was trying to automate the ADSR controls. And he was having an issue with that in Cubase. So let's have a quick look here. I did something that boards on the ridiculous. Here. You won't be able to see, I automated the volume control, you won't be able to see that, but you'll be able to watch the ADSR controls there and see how they change. Anyway, that's how easy it is to automate play in Mixcraft.